Welcome back to the channel. So first of all, just log in with your Looker credentials. And once you log in, the Looker interface must be look like this. Now click on this development mode. It will take a couple of seconds. Meanwhile, just go to your lab instruction and just go to the task number one. Just scroll down, copy this thing. Okay, copy this code. Now click on this develop. Then click on this quick lab e-commerce. Now here click on this view option and from here just users dot view okay now let me just zoom in for you as you can see just anywhere you want to just click over here after the closing bracket as you can see okay just hit enter two times and paste that code okay now again hit two, uh, two times then go to the task number two scroll down copy this code and paste okay make sure there is one extra space as you can see okay again hit enter button two times then go to the task number three okay okay now just paste that code again here okay now click on save then click on this validation code click on commit and you can just give anything i'm just giving commit one and click on commit just wait for a second and click on deploy to production so you are done with the task number one two three now for the task number four we have to go to different file so if you just scroll down here you can see the file name is order underscore items dot view okay so now just copy this code okay then go to order underscore items view file and here just scroll down and whenever you want after the closing bracket just hit enter twice and paste that code which you copy from here okay and now just go to the last task scroll down copy this code and again hit enter twice and paste that code make sure there is an extra space over here as you can see now click on this save click on validation look ml click on commit again i'm just going to commit to you can do anything Click on commit then just wait for a second and click on deploy to production that's the thing we have to do now if we just go to the task number one and simply click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue then check the score for task number two you will get a score without any issue then check the score for task number three four and five So as you can see i got the first full score for this lab and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day